guys big bruce here all right let's build a small barn we're going to do a little diorama piece today okay so we got some of the base being glued and pressed together right now put a little weight on it while the glue sets got some old boards that i've made up that we're going to cut down for the walls and stuff just going to do some diorama stuff we've been thinking about putting some red lines into dioramas so we're going to work on that a couple of custom pieces that i've been working on just little paint jobs and stuff and adding some detail so but yeah you guys know me man i work on 10 15 different things at a time that's why the customs table always looks like a hot mess and we do use other types of wood too but popsicle sticks man just cost effective it works out pretty good so let's see where this goes all right so we got the sideboards up cut a door into it i've even built a little fireplace and chimney <clears throat> Sorry guys, I know I always skip a bunch of steps, man, but uh, I kind of work in sections, so But I think it's turning out pretty good Another little barn cut away Now to figure out what goes inside of it and the finishing details also Little 510 turned out pretty good. I don't know if you can tell with the video being as dark as it is, but took one of the headlights out and drilled it for intake. We blacked her all out. Do a wheel swap, some more detail on that. It'll be fun. Got the little Civic hatch there. Kind of made it look like a carbon fiber panel has been put into it. So yeah, as always, man, we're always uh, tinkering with something. Anyways, let's see where it goes next, guys. Yeah, so I've stained it with my black wash and built the shelving to go inside of it. We'll fire the uh, the stove later on, make it hard. It's just clay. But we'll do several layers, and then I'll actually take and sand it away, and it'll review other layers, and it gives a really nice kind of uh, aged look. Put a little moss on the roof would be good to go. You're up. Okay, so we got about three layers of paint. Started to bring it down. It's starting to look pretty good. Add some moss and stuff to it. We'll see how she turns right, yeah, out. So we got some of the interior put together. We got the burning wood burning stove, some tires on the shelf, some hubcaps, some Mustang lights, some grills and stuff. I think it's going to turn out pretty good. All right, everybody. So we added all the small parts into it. Sorry, the shadowing's kind of hard to tell. The lighting's not the best in the room. The car is planted. We flattened a back tire. This is a real custom T-Bird red line that I patinaed up. Got the layers of the paint done. A little moss growing on the roof. Take it down here and twist it around so everybody can see it. But I think it turned out pretty good. This is my first red line diorama. Take an old, just basically uh, only good for restoration or just for the scrap pile, red line and breathe some life back into it. Let me know what you guys think. As always, I appreciate everybody watching the videos. Hit that like button. Go check out the Instagram channel. Leave a comment. And as always, do something for you and take it easy.